Sign up for free Stratfor Intelligence. Simply enter your email address to receive two free reports each week. Belarus opened negotiations with the IMF on June 1st in order to acquire a loan of somewhere between $3.5 to $8 billion. These negotiations come as Belarus is facing some serious financial troubles. These troubles could open the opportunity for increased competition between the West and Russia over Belarus, and this could have significant regional implications. Belarus began to experience financial difficulties in the beginning of 2011 as a result of a surge in populist spending by Belarusian President Alexander Lukashenko leading up to the country's presidential elections in December 2010. Lukashenko increased social spending considerably leading up to these elections, and combined with the high global energy prices, this put a lot of pressure on Belarus's economy and financial system. Belarus experienced a shortage of foreign exchange reserves and was forced to devalue its currency. Meanwhile, many state banks in Belarus were downgraded by credit agencies, and there was a run on banks and ATMs across the country. Belarus's ability to deal with these financial difficulties were extremely limited, mainly because of political considerations. Belarus faced isolation from the West in response to what the West deemed as rigged elections in December 2010, and particularly Lukashenko's crackdown on protesters following these elections. In response, the West enacted sanctions against Belarus and removed the option of providing financial assistance to the country in its time of need. Therefore, Belarus was forced to turn to its only other option, which is Russia. After weeks of negotiations, Belarus was able to secure a 3 to $3.5 billion loan from the Russian-dominated Eurosec Anti-Crisis Fund. What this has done has severely limited Lukashenko's room for maneuver in his relationship with Moscow due to his financial dependence on Russia. Now Belarus is looking to open up its options again by looking to the IMF. However, there are several obstacles and challenges to Belarus receiving a loan from the IMF, particularly the reforms that are usually tied to such IMF loans, which Lukashenko is simply not willing to enact, politically speaking. Therefore, the only realistic and viable option for Belarus to turn to to allay its economic troubles is Moscow. Russia's position will not only strengthen in Belarus, but will also strengthen its leverage over regional players such as Poland and the Baltic states as they also try to strengthen their position in Belarus.